The Grizzly Tracker. She sure is serving me well, especially with the guide service. Oh, hey, I'm Mike. Where are you from, Mike? Chicago. Chicago. I didn't even know I was being recorded. Right. <laughs> this is a heat wave for Mike. We're at 60 something degrees. Yeah, I left home. It was 11. So. 11. It was fun to see old Mike get out of the cold and into the Grizz. Tracker's so light, I can go in just a few inches of water, I can run fast to different flats. She's a fish slaying machine. Down south? Down to down south. What were you doing with it though? Oh, I was just letting it drop, twitching. I'll take this shrimp proke here, and I feel that little cavity. Since we're working these baits slow in the winter. Everybody loves the Grizz. Mike Watson, my wife Kristen, we're from uh, Corpus Christi. Plenty of adventures we've had in the Grizzly Tracker. I can have three people in the boat, we can float in a few inches of water, I can pole it. It's super versatile on these flats. Oh, that's a good fish. That's a good red. And if anybody loves the Grizzly Tracker, it's my wife, Teresa, the fish finder. Smoke. Oh my god. It's a feeding frenzy right there. Good lord. Come on in. Y'all got bad aim. Such bad aim. Holy smokes with the bad aim. Oh, he got it that time. Oh, just look at it. Well, that ain't no. That's a trout. That's a trout, baby doll. Oh, he's off. Electro motor says mega shower. And as much as we both love the Grizzly Tracker, sometimes there's just not a boat launch where we want to put in. That's where the plastic pelican comes in. We did a school yesterday, thought we'd come back and try it again. That's, That's about a 25 incher though. Really? Right by the gill. I believe it. I never felt it. That's a great, awesome move. <laughs> It's a rare combination. We're able to launch a small boat, a 12 foot boat, at a kayak launch. Stand and throw like we're in a bass tournament. Pelican Intruder with a little troll motor is almost as dangerous as the Grizzly. Something is pushing the front of that. No, it's a trout. Oh my God. It's a big oh. trout, huh? Oh my God. It's a good trout. Really good trout. He's hooked pretty good. And when Teresa's in the front of that pelican, the fish finder comes out. Good work. Big trout. You see the weight he made? Yeah. Something big as well. Yeah. I bounced that off of a fish. I popped him in there back. In the Pelican, we've got the option to drift if there's a breeze. We can push pull it or we can troll like we're in a bass boat. It's flat calm today, so trolling and sight casting or just throwing top water is the ticket. You ever throw this mirror lure, mirror lure top water plug, you're missing out. Check out the action. This is the snakiest action I think I've ever seen on the plug. Look at this. That's a sidewinded fool. Oh, that's a good one. Oh my god, it's my oh my god. That's a monster. Can we baby him? Can we baby him? Wow. That is a huge one. Good job, honey. Thank you. Well, we gotta see how big he is. Can you see that? Look at the action on that. Ooh, like a 19. God, he's fat. On this day, the troll motor was left on one. It's real slow. Teresa was working the drop off with plastics and top water. Boom, it was paying off time after time after time. There's a beast on an AM too. 
his mouth. <laughs> he barely got a word. I know. Oh, good job. Purple AM? Yeah. Wow. I didn't know we had those. I had one left. Ooh, that's a beautiful trout. They can't stand the stink on them AM lures. And bigger the bait, bigger the fish. That long purple curly tail causes a lot of action in the water, and they gotta have it. I actually prefer them to. Goodbye. <laughs> That's Good a big fat. Good job, honey. Pelican strikes again with tree sanity. What's going on? <laughs> really? Yeah, I see it like a 24. It's been right in half. Were the schools back here? Yeah, there were schools by that pier. There's so much bait. You see like long streams of bait. That's where you're at. And uh, you just got to look for the swirls around the bait, you know, like you do. Oh my gosh, yeah, hell yeah. Good job. Why can't I do that on a tournament day, man? <laughs> you got sharked? I got attacked. Oh my gosh. Those black tips are so thick in here right now. You didn't feel it? No. You just yeah, clean cut? Wow. Yeah, that's a good. clean shark bite. I'm gonna hit you. That's here. right. Ram them. Man, that's nuts. <laughs> First time I've seen somebody get chomped this far inland. So like I said, we can stand and throw in the pelican, put it on one and just slowly creep around, throw top water, plastics, whatever. And if I'm inclined to, we get on the super skinny water, I can grab the push pole. And for a $700 plastic bathtub with a $150 troll motor, man, it's hard to beat. It's really just get him. Is it him or another one? I don't know. Is that a trout? I don't know what that is. I think I saw silver, honey. Here we saw a tail and we were trying to sight cast and Teresa's just false casting. I guess she just hung another little red yeah. slot red. Yeah. A little just under slaughter. Oh, it might be a slot. Had a little gulp. New school paddle tail. Oh, there you go, honey. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, he's ready. Come Not on. keeping anything today. No. Got to get back in that office. Can't be cleaning fish today. Mm -hmm. We'll keep them in our in our personal refrigerator, the bay. Mm -hmm. Come get them when we need to eat some fish. Sometimes it's nice to just jump out the pelican and cool down a bit. Sea turtle. How pretty. Don't normally see a lot of those back here. That means the salinity is really hot. Yeah, three legs. Does he? Yep. Missing a back paddle. Sir limps a lot. Sea turtles love the grass you're seeing here. Widgeon grass, manatee grass, but they also love turtle grass. We've got it all. Well, it's time to take it back in. So we put her on one and we just kind of Bang all the structures all the way back to the boat ramp. Sure is a lot of fun in the old Pelican. Jumping in sure help. Now I'm going to crank her up to three or four and just glide on in. But every now and then, when you have power and your friends are pedaling, sometimes you just gotta give them a lift. Y'all going all the way across? Yeah, you're about to launch it. Y'all yeah, diehards, man. Early. And there's a launch. We're close to the launch. Taxi service. Ty's taxi service. What? <laughs> <laughs> There you go. We'll send David and Tammy on their way and we'll head back to the boat ramp. Another great day of fishing and a pelican intruder.
All right, we all have fun. Whether we're in the Grizzly or the Pelican, we always have a blast. And we always meet great people on the water and at the boat ramp. And who knows, maybe we'll see you out on the water sometime. Thanks for watching 30 Miles Out.